Hello guys, what's up? Today, I'm going to show you how to download the Cape Slash Cloak mod. Uh, before I start, I kind of want to ask you guys a question and to get kind of get your opinion on it. Um, who do you think would win in a fight? Darth Maul or Wolverine? It's uh, something I saw on IGN the other day. I, I swear, I think Darth Maul could beat Wolverine, but people seem to think that Wolverine could take Darth Maul. I just wanted to get your guys' opinion on that. Didn't see what you guys Avast had to say. Virus database has been updated. That's very nice, Avast. Okay, but yeah, let's get into it, guys. Okay, so this is the cloak slash cape mod. I call it cl uh, cape, but it says cloak. So I'm going to show you guys how I downloaded it. Pretty much, there's files compatible with Zom's fly mod and ones compatible that aren't compatible. I'm going to show you guys how to download the one that isn't compatible with Zom's fly mod, but maybe I'll do a later video showing you how to do the one that is compatible. <laughs> Okay, so right here, I'll put this link in the description. You click the past bin, uh, and then it'll take you to AdFly. Don't worry, though. Next, you wanna after this is the five seconds done, you wanna skip ad, and then it takes you to this. Pretty much, it tell you can either get a Mojang cloak, a Mudkip cloak, a Creeper cloak, a Flarg custom cloak, Harry Potter themed, and a Naru Maki's custom cloak. You pretty much just copy like the link and put it in the in the address bar at the top and then you hit enter so I'll show you with the Mojang cloak <clears throat> the cloak open link and it'll bring you to AdFly again you just wait the five seconds as usual skip add you download it literally takes two seconds I've already pre-downloaded it but yeah so pretty much it will download, you save it to your desktop, you can just exit out of there. You'll get a file, it'll be called G, it'll be called uh, GS Mojang, I think. You need to rename the file, you just right click, hit rename, just rename it GS. Just GS, that's all. It's gonna look like, it's gonna look like this. Right here. This is all you need. Now you go to the bottom, you go app, or percent app data, whoop. So you go down to the Minecraft bin, you go to .minecraft, this mod is super easy to install guys. It is a little bit glitchy sometimes when logging in, but that that's okay. You go to the bin, you go to the jar, <coughs> okay so you, all, you, all you have to do is drag this file in here, drop it as usual, and it will just copy in there. Remember to delete the meta inf. Or else the mod will not work, as usual. <laughs> so now you just exit off. After you start up your Minecraft and everything, see I'm running set 1.7.3. I'll just go to my single single player, and you're gonna see this pretty sweet cape on me. Ooh, see, watch. Look at this sweet cape. Look at. It's like the cape that Notch wears. It's kind of, it was like kind of a Notch only thing. And you may be noticing I'm wearing a dead mouse suit. I wonder what that could mean. Stay tuned for another video from me later, and if you guys, uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave it a like, and feel free to subscribe if you want to see more. Remember to leave in the comment below who you think would win a fight, Wolverine or Darth Maul. Thanks guys, I'm out.